these are our two uh, species of the American alligator. Uh, this one was um, a larger male, probably around nine to 10 foot long. This one's a little bit smaller, about four, four to five foot long. This is about average size that we see in and around Lake Waccamaw. Uh, alligators are an, an important species here in the ecosystem. They're what we call an apex predator. Uh, they consume uh, small mammals, amphibians, fish, insects. The hatchlings, or the, uh, the young, when they're first hatched, will uh, feed off of small uh, invertebrates, insects, uh, worms, things of that nature. Uh, alligators are a beautiful species. We, we encourage people to come out to Lake Waccamaw to have viewing opportunities of alligators, uh, but they're meant to be left undisturbed. Uh, we encourage people not to feed them. Uh, if you're going to watch them, please view them from a safe distance, especially during the warmer months. They're not typically an aggressive species unless they are provoked. There's never been any recorded attacks in and around Lake Waccamaw. But again, uh, we, we encourage people not to feed alligators. If they are fed, then we have to look at relocation uh, because they can become dangerous at that point. They can actually shed their teeth and regrow new teeth over their lifetime. An average lifespan of an alligator is about 40 to 50 years, but they can live beyond that. So during that time, they can uh, grow new teeth. Uh, their jaws are extremely powerful. Um, when they're in this position, when it's closed, they don't have a lot of force to open jaws. But when these jaws are open, they have crushing force. There are several thousand pounds of pressure uh, when those jaws come down. So I have seen them actually crack a turtle shell before. Uh, it's not uncommon to see that out here in the wild. They're extremely powerful, like I said, out of water, just as much as they are in water. They're very, very strong animals. There's never been any problems with human intervention with alligators being out here at Lake Waccamaw. But again, we encourage people to maintain a safe distance and just respect these creatures out here. As with any wildlife, we encourage you to let wildlife be wild. Uh, don't, uh, don't disturb it. Uh, and they're meant to be uh, left alone. Um, we certainly don't want human uh, intervention with any of these species that are out here. But please come and we encourage you to get out to have wonderful viewing opportunities of wildlife at Lake Waccamaw State Park.